are going to do some stretching. So if you're choosing to join me post-workout for a little stretch, we're going to hold all of our stretches. Rather than them being dynamic, they're going to be passive. So holding more yin, more slow, just to focus on a release and focusing on the breath. Okay, soaking up the beautiful energy of where we are. So the first one, let me pop our little timer on, is to come into a lunge position. Now, we're actually going to hold this position and go lower and lower and lower, like we're going to spread further and further until we're down here, over the course of 30 seconds. Okay, so let me reset. Find your little lunge, have something nearby to hold on to if you need, and off we go. So we're holding everything for 30 seconds. So staying tall through the crown of the head, rather than moving forwards as we sink down, we wanna go just down towards the floor. So you need to separate your feet that little bit further. So you might like to start up higher and then slowly start sinking down. So let's come down. Normally you'd wanna keep your back knee as straight as you can. Obviously if you can't, that is fine. Coming down, coming down more, holding at the bottom and then dropping the knee and just holding here. Let's hold here for 30 seconds. So just letting everything sink down towards the floor, keeping the knee in line with the ankle, feeling tall. Try not to arch through the back, just stay lifted. If you need to slightly lean forward, that's fine. Long, deep breathing. And then we're going into a bit of a hamstring stretch in a minute. So we're gonna sit back Sitting back on the heel. If you need something close by, you can. Toes towards your nose. Otherwise, hands down by the sides. If you need or want to place your hand on you, make sure it's on your thigh, never on your knee. Long, deep breathing. Long, deep breathing. Releasing. I love these rocks. I love these rocks and I hope you like yours if you got your little package from me so come down into our little pigeon so coming down resting on the knee on the leg and stretching the other one back let me just restart our timer and holding here for 30 seconds either up on your hands or you can come down on your elbows or you can fully rest down on your forehead Long deep breathing. And then after this, we're going to repeat everything on the other side, but with no talking, just breathing. Okay, pressing up. Let's press back into a elephant downward dog. And then tiptoeing those feet all the way up. And then we're gonna repeat on the other side. So get ready to come into that lunge, start really high, and then I'll say when to, whoa, when to lower down. Off we go. Come down a little bit. Down a little more. Stay tall. Down a little more. And then drop the knee down and hold this position. Keeping the knee down, slight lean forward. Allow the hip to release. And then sit back to stretch out your hamstring. Toes towards your nose, either holding onto something or fingertips on the ground. Keep your hips square, facing forwards.
Okay, now from here, coming into our little pigeon. So crossing that leg, wiggling down and sitting in a comfortable position on your hands, on your elbows or all the way down. Okay, and from here, pressing back into our elephant. Mm, walking those feet. We're going to do an inner thigh standing stretch, rolling on up. So what we're going to do is spread those legs wide. We're going to turn the toes in. We're going to hinge forwards from the hips. And we're going to hold this position. We want to lean slightly back so you could lift those toes off the floor. Okay, so sitting back, you can hold your hands out in front like you are waiting for a little gift in your hands. And you're just going to sit back, feel the stretch through the back of the legs, through the inner thigh. Keep those toes lifted. Keep the toes lifted. Keep engaging your tummy, so breathe under your brace. Oh, that's a cute little rock. Keep that. And then you're going to bend the knees and then tip forward. So your heels are just slightly lifting off the floor and you're tipping forwards like you're going to lean, lean, lean down towards the floor. Tip, tip, tip. Bend the knees. Like you're just balancing on your tippy toes. And this is more high up in the groin. Okay, now from here, bring your legs back together, dropping the knees, holding the hands behind, and then just letting the body reach over and forwards, bring the arms up overhead. Looking between the legs, you could either do this like this, or you could do this one standing, looking at me. And then slowly rolling on up. And that is our little stretch complete. Hope you enjoyed it. Really, really basic, really simple, but can be completed after any of our sessions in any of the weeks because it is a static stretch. So it feels really nice. Thanks for joining me with this beautiful energy. Remember to sip on your tea. Remember to take care of yourself. You are worthy. You are loved and you are so valuable.